here's news of one very lucky woman. She's 84 years old. She lives in Florida. And she's been identified as the winner of the largest unshared jackpot in US history. But Gloria McKenzie, perhaps on account of her advanced years, has chosen to take an immediate lump sum payment rather than receiving her winnings over a 30-year period. So she'll get less than originally intended. She'll get $370 million. Not bad. <laughs> We are making history at the Florida Lottery headquarters today, and we do often, because we have a whole lot of winners in Florida. Saturday, May 18th, the multi-state Powerball game held its drawing right here in this building for a $590 million jackpot, the largest jackpot ever offered in the game's 21-year history. As you know, one lucky Florida ticket was the sole winner of the jackpot making it the largest winning lottery ticket ever in American lottery history. Today, I had the news we've all been waiting for. The winner has come forward, the ticket has been validated at lottery headquarters, and the winner of the $590 million jackpot is Mrs. Gloria C. McKenzie, 84 years of age, of Zephyr Hills, Florida. For Gloria McKenzie and her son Scott, life will never be the same again. But just how the 84-year-old came to buy her winning lottery ticket at a Florida supermarket has got the whole of America talking. Tonight we have the biggest jackpot in Powerball history. It's an estimated $590.5 million. I hope you've got her $2 ticket matched all six numbers. The jackpot hadn't been won for two months. Not surprising given that the odds were 175 million to one. Gloria and her family have asked for their privacy to be respected. It's not known if she has any plans to find the Good Samaritan who let her take their place in the queue. 